Hey, Dave LeCount with Head Games Motorworks. Today, we're going to pocket port a Honda K Series. Check it out. Now, you're probably wondering where does a pocket port fit with the K Series? Well, we don't full port them until about, I don't know, all motor because we've made 1400 with them with just a pocket port. The issue with the full port is that although you would think that you would need the extra airflow, uh, we have found that sometimes they crack. They crack in the center of the head over by the, uh, the spark plug tubes and that makes it useless. So, and we, don't, we actually don't even make them that big. We make them a normal size. We don't take them out to a gasket. We don't make them bigger than a gasket. We don't do any of that stuff and they still crack. So what we do is we pocket port them, we put good parts in them, put bronze guides in them, and we make them flow better, and they'll make 1400 as is. So this guy wants to make around 1000 We do our pocket port package. We're going to put some Super Tech valve train in it, and um, check it out. All right, what am I going to be using? I'm going to be using the Head Games Super Spiral Burr, quarter Super Spiral Burr, this is a bad dude. This is the honey badger of burrs. Um, and I want to use this because it will take out a lot of meat very quickly. But also, I'm trying to keep the shape. A lot of uh, times you're going to use a smaller burr and then you're trying to shape it. You're doing all kinds of stuff to shape it. I don't want to be doing that. I don't want you guys to be doing that. But I need to show you how we use this versus the small thing. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm going to go back over it. And I'm going to make it nicer with a smaller one, but I'm not going to hog it. I'm not going to start the port with the small one. I'm going to, I'm going to rough it out and then we're going to go back over it. I'm going to be using my GD0603 electric grinder, Makita. This is a bad dude. It's like 120 bucks and I'm going to use a Goodson speed controller and um, we're going to get at it. So look, see I poured it right here, and I'm porting right here, and I'm not going any farther. So when I'm grinding it, basically, I'm not going any farther than this. And I see a lot of guys who will go all the way up. So what I'm doing here is I'm grinding up to here. And this is just my finger, right? I'm not even holding the grinder. But when you see when I was grinding, I'm only going this far because that's as far as it will naturally go. I see guys going up here and over here. They go all over the place. What I suggest is just to keep it in order. So you do this wall, you do this wall, you do this wall, or I should say this part, right? And then you flip it and you do the short side. But don't go and think that you're just going to be the hero and be able to shape this from a different angle. You're just not. So I would pour it here 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 and instead of using a round a big round piece because it keeps the shape now from OEM that is not actually round and we're gonna make it round Doing the short turns is a very tricky thing because A, you just have to keep it a turn. So what you want to do is you want to go in. So you go inside and then you work your way out. You don't want to go from here in because you have a very good chance of flattening it. But if you go from this side in, I found that it'd be much easier to keep the shape. You can also see that I stopped in the corners here. So I stopped in the corner because as I said that's as far as you can go naturally and then you're going to blend it all in from this side. The short turn is the make or break. If you get this wrong you're not getting it back. 
and you're gonna ruin the head. So make sure you do it right. Now that I roughed it in with the head games, super spiral burr, three quarter, I'm gonna go back into it with the half inch burr. Now I'll go back in with the half inch burr because I wanna make the shape really nice and easy to fine grind. When I say fine grind, I mean I'm gonna make it, I'm not gonna sand it, but I'm gonna hit it with a double cut burr after this and just make it nicey nice. So I'm going to switch back over to the Head Games Half Inch Super Spiral Burr and we're going to do the exhaust. Same thing here guys, when you're doing the short turns, you can make the wider turn here and that's gonna add some airflow. The K-Series is great for this and uh, there's tons of room there. Now you don't wanna go too wide. Uh, it's really hard to explain to you or actually I just don't wanna give out my whole secret here of how wide I would make that, but um, you just know that you can make it a little bit wider and it would help airflow. You also wanna take off uh, the turn when you when you start making the turn there's gonna be a bump on top of the short turn and you want to make that completely round so you want to start at the back and move your all the way up front just like I showed you before so you're gonna come here and what I did was I make this corner here and this corner here and make it wider and then I come in here and come all the way out now it's time to switch back to, to the head games double cut burr and uh, go back over everything and just make it a little nice and nice.
Guys, you see where the grinder didn't touch? Right here? I don't want you guys to dig this out. And I say that because a lot of guys think that you need to dig that out and it has to be completely conformed or you're not doing a good job. Here's the situation here. If you make this here, if you dug that out, it actually makes it too large. And making it too big is gonna make it worse than if you made it too small. If you're gonna be off, you wanna be off small. And if I definitely suggest that you get something like these, these calipers go inside here. And this way you can double check your work. You can make sure that you are staying uh, consistent. So you can put these inside here, make sure they're, they're not only they're consistent, but then you can measure it with a caliper and make sure you're to the right size. Too small, you know it, too big, everybody knows it because you're just gonna slow it down. You're gonna slow down the airspeed, you're gonna slow down the cylinder head, you're gonna slow down the car. You definitely never wanna make it too big. If you're gonna be off, you wanna be off small. That goes for any port. You don't wanna be too big. A lot of guys, although, they don't do shit to the head and then um, it's way too small and doesn't give you any kind of gain, but that's definitely better than making it too big. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed that little how-to video on the K-Series. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment below. Please tell me what you guys want to see. I would love to hear from you. Toodles.